Hey everyone, wanted to show you a cool technique in Ableton Live. It lets you do some kind of mind bending stuff with your instruments. So basically it lets you grab a, uh, an audio clip that you've recorded with an instrument like a guitar or a keyboard and then uh, map that as a MIDI instrument that you can then control slices of with your hardware, like a MIDI controller, a push, or uh, something else like that. So to show this off, I mean, let me listen to this guitar riff that I recorded. I posted this a couple days ago, you might recognize it. Simple little riff. Okay, now all you have to do is right click on the audio instrument and then you'll see an option for slice to new MIDI track. And when you click it, it gives you a few options. It says create one slice per and you can set the interval, the amount of time that you want your riff divided into and each of those little segments of time will be mapped onto a button on your hardware controller. Now I picked quarter note so that each quarter note of the riff would be mapped onto one of my buttons. And I've already done that and the, uh, the riff itself is here and you can see that as I just cycle through my buttons on my controller, it's, it's already mapped my slices here, it actually will play the riff, like listen. Now you might be thinking, well, how, why, well, why would you want to do that? Why would you want to just play it through again? Well, I'm not going to. I'm going to, I'm going to make a whole new riff kind of with this. You can do totally glitched out things with this. So, so it lets you kind of uh, <laughs> reuse um, clips that you've made in really cool uh, new ways. I've already been laying down this like new section of the song using my MIDI sliced uh, audio riff. Okay, that's the technique. Um, right click on an audio track, slice it up, uh, pick the interval, how long you want that slice to be, map it, make a new riff entirely. Bye all.